What's going on everybody? I got a quick one for you today. I picked up some cool vintage pieces uh, from a friend of mine, Stackmaster G. You might be familiar with him. Um, used to be on YouTube quite a bit, mostly on Instagram these days. You know, if, uh, if you're familiar with him, you know he has uh, quite the collection. has an extremely wonderful, beautiful collection of vintage bars and, and uh, rounds and, and what have you. He has a uh, Really, really nice stuff. Well, he had some things up for sale on Instagram, and I went ahead and contacted him and, and picked up a few of them. So that's what I'm going to share with you today. And uh, the first piece here, I'm going to show you. Let's go ahead and zoom in. I did not have any of these in my collection. These are from the 70s. Um, this is one of the Swiss of America. They call a Rolo. Um, it's thick. It, this one is about a quarter inch thick. And these come from the Draper Mint from Draper, Utah. Again, these were made in the 70s. And I've always wanted to have these in my stack. So I had, I had a chance to pick up some from him. I was real happy with that. These are 23.5 millimeters and like I said, a quarter inch thick. And these are pretty darn cool. I gotta admit, these I like the chunky rounds. These are nice and smooth on the sides. And I went ahead and picked up a few from him. I picked up some of these Swiss of America, as you can see, and uh, there's a little bit, little bit of difference there between this one and this one, as you can see. Not, not a whole lot, but there are, they are different. These are, these are pretty collectible, rare, more rare pieces, anyways. I wouldn't say extremely rare, but you see them from time to time, and, and I wanted to add, add a few. To the collection and the next one uh, that they did make a couple different types and the next one here you can see the Golden West the Tenton there's the Tenton Mountain that's from the, uh, the Grand Tenton Mountain or the Grand Tenton National Park I should say rather and, and the mountains in uh, in Wyoming this one is the more rare of the two and this one is a beautiful beautiful example that he sent me and I did go ahead and get a um, a couple of these as well so you can see detail on these were pretty pretty neat back in the day nice little view there they all have the same the same back on them and uh, so that's that's what I picked up from stack master G let's go ahead and zoom out so I uh, again I, I enjoy the vintage pieces and um, this was my first transaction with him and I've known him known him for for quite a while just just talking back and forth a little bit on um, through the social media but uh, yeah definitely definitely a fun pickup enjoy these um, thanks uh, stack master G if you do watch this I appreciate it buddy um, thank you for sending me some nice examples and and uh, real glad to have these into my stack so there we go guys five more ounces of, of vintage silver and uh, just having fun with it hope you guys have a a good day and please like comment subscribe if you feel like it or follow an upvote on steam it please and uh, i appreciate you guys thanks for stopping by